Hi, YouTube. So it's your girl, Tamika Renee, and I'm back with another video. So if you haven't seen my video that I just posted about putting up my Christmas tree and I was arguing with my honey or whatever, go check that out because I think y'all gonna enjoy that video. So this is how it looked afterwards. I wanna show you guys because when I finished that video, I didn't get to show y'all the final results. So look, this is the final results. So I got my um, stockings up. You know, for my son, me, and then um, Stanley. And then down here, I need to get the snow to cover the things at the bottom, the sticks, the stand, I mean. I need that snow cover thing. And then I probably want like a snow, like a, um, a Santa Claus, a stand-up Santa Claus to go right there or something. You know, to stand up or something like that. But I'm definitely not done decorating and it's already December 12th it's december 12th today it's my sister birthday today but i'm not done decorating like i want to get the reef on the outside of my door <laughs> and then i have a window that you actually can see like if you're coming up to my place you can see that window i want to put some like christmas stuff in there like some lights or something like that but yeah this is how the christmas tree look you guys it is so cute i got this from walmart.com i ordered it it's from costway the brand costway and it was on sale for 89.99 and it was originally like 150 or maybe 200, if I'm not mistaken. And it was on sale. So I copped that really quick because I knew I wanted a nice tree. This is 6.5 feet. So it's definitely taller than me. And then it came with acorns and berries on it. You guys, look. It's so pretty. And then it came with the lights too. The lights are in it too. This I actually bought myself. And I bought this from Walmart, but I actually went in the store. I didn't buy it online. It's like a birdhouse. It's a birdhouse. And I just put it right up in there. Right up in the tree. So it could be, you know, so it can have a place to a place to be. Because it's a little bit on the heavy side, so. Yes, it's a little bit on the heavy side, so it don't really um hold it up well. And then I got um the the ornament with Jesus, Mary, and the baby. Kind of look like a lighthouse to me. But I got that from Walmart as well. So that's how I was looking on the tree. So I still got to get ornaments for this tree. And I think I'm going to do gold. Or if I see silver, I'll do all silver. But I just want to do one color ornament. And I'm going to do um, either gold or silver. That's what I'm aiming for for my tree. And then, um, you guys, I just want to make sure you guys go check that last video out. Because that's me setting up that tree by myself. And I was arguing because I was setting it up by myself. So I want to show you guys what I got from the store before I put it up. And I went to Smith's to get this stuff. So I'm going to show y'all what I got really quick. And I got me a drink from Starbucks. And I got the white chocolate frap. White chocolate mocha frap. Vente size. Okay. So, I have put some stuff up already, but I'm going to show y'all what I got. I got some pops. Oh, I got my nails done too, y'all. Make sure you guys, because this is the beginning of the video, make sure you go subscribe to my channel. Please! <laughs> make sure y'all go subscribe to my channel. Okay? And make sure you, um... Like this video if you enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? Don't like it if you don't enjoy it. Dislike it. Mm -hmm. And um, what else am I about to say? Oh, leave me a comment down below. You know, tell your girl how she doing. Yeah. Okay, anyway, so pop cereal. Not for me, for my honey. Oh, let me show you my nails. I got my nails done, you guys. Look. So I got this idea from Pinterest, if y'all didn't know. From Pinterest, y'all see them? So this one kind of like glittery, it's just not white, it's gl it got glitter on it, but I don't know if y'all could see that. So yeah, this is how it's looking. They're adorbs, you guys, so I might get it done before Christmas, though, because it's only the 12th and I got it done on the 10th, so it might be a redo and I might get them blue with like a Christmas theme still, so. So I got Pop cereal for my honey, Fruity Pebbles for me, Honey Nut Cheerios for my honey. 
So let me put them up in the pantry. That's where I put them up in the pantry. Yeah, pantry. We always get a lot of cereal because to me, I feel like cereal is just like noodles. Like when you're running out of food, what do you resort to? You resort to noodles. And that's how I look at cereal as like, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I really do. That's how I look at cereal as like, that's a freaking go-to when you don't have no, you know, no extra money or no extra time on your hands to go get no food. So I did get treetop apple juice and I got two of these for my little baby bear, Jamarion. I only got one son, one child, and he just turned three years old, October 16th. And, um, you know, I got to give him a couple of things. So I got two of these because I usually get the big one, but in my refrigerator, it can't fit at the bottom. And in the middle rack where it fits at, when I get the big one, I always got to go uh, to tug it underneath the line. And I'll show you guys. If I go to the refrigerator. But yeah, so I got two of these. And um, I actually got a receipt. So everything that I'm show you guys, I spent. One forty eight fifty four. Look. Wait. Yeah, so I spent. One forty-eight fifty-four, and these apple juices was two for four, and I didn't know that. Yeah, two for four, and these were two for four too. I got two V eights for my honey. He liked V eight, so I got him watermelon cherry. I don't think he ever tried that one, so I just got that because I never seen it. And then I got the flavor fruit medley. And that's the me that's the cereal I love too, but I hadn't gotten none this time. I love the medley crunch from by um Cheerios, if I'm not mistaken. It's so good. Okay, so the rest of the cereal I got, I got raisin bread crunch from my honey. This is what he like. So you guys got two V8s I show y'all, two treetop apple juices, and I got 1% milk from Anderson. 1% milk. I wanted to get two of them, but I just got one this time because I'm like, oh, I wasn't really trying to go shopping like that because it, it don't be a, it just be so much coming up these stairs. You know, that's why when I get my first house, I want one floor because I don't like the stairs. You know, I just don't. Okay. So I'm just showing y'all guys all my drinks. So I got orange juice as well, but I got a pint of it because we don't really eat, drink orange juice like that. So I just got this type, which is a half a gallon. And that's just an orange juice original. The Kroger brand, which I really enjoy. I don't like Simply. And I know y'all gonna be like, why you don't like Simply? Why you don't like Simply? Wait, I do like Simply orange juice, it's okay. Um, I do like Simply orange juice. I don't like the... I can't think of it. It's too potent. It's too it's too fake. I don't like no fake orange juice. I like the real orange juice taste. The real, you know. I, I really do though. I really enjoy the real orange juice. Okay. So, and it can have a little pup in it too. I like me some pup. So, this is the oatmeal that I got. Quaker brand. 18 packets value pack. So it is the instant oatmeal, fruit and cream. It got strawberries and cream, peaches and cream, blueberries and cream, and bananas and cream. This come in handy, especially me being on a diet and all. It comes in handy for me in the morning. I just put me on some oatmeal and I drink some water and I call it a day for the morning. Or I might eat some oatmeal and a boiled egg, you know? And then I call it a day. So. I gotta go put this up. See, that it ain't easy for you to blame everything on me. If that's the case, I just go have my fun. Do all the things you say I do. Boy, I can't. It's easier to take this from you. I might as well. <sighs> my refrigerator empty, y'all. Let me show y'all. It's my empty. Empty. I call this empty. Like nothing in the second row. These two milks is not mine. This is my um, mother-in-law's milks. 
So she drink these with her smoothie. Coconut almond milk. Ugh. Y'all probably like it though. The health the healthy you the healthy people probably like that. And then she drink she gonna try this out with her smoothie now. She haven't opened it, but it's the almond silk. I tried it before though. It's good. I don't know if I tried that brand, but I like almond milk. It's a good substitute for milk, but especially because oh, I had read some stuff up on milk and I had just got disgusted and I just stopped drinking it. So I was just like, ugh. So currently putting them juices in here. in there orange juice and milk and then I'll show you guys how it look after I put it in there okay so let me tell you how much that was the um tell you how much that was the milk the anderson milk 1% was $3.99 the orange juice was $2.79 that's sad because it was a half a gallon damn okay and what else? Okay, I showed, I told y'all the V8 price, the apple juice price. Okay, the cereal. Okay, the Honey Nut Cheerios was four twenty nine. Fruity Pebbles was three ninety nine. Raisin Bran Crunch was three ninety nine. Cinnamon Toast Crunch was seven two seventy nine. And I didn't show y'all that that bag over here. But yeah, that's the cereal prices. Um, and then I got the Oops All Berries. That was $2.79. So yeah. So now I'm about to show you. Um, I got Uncle Ben's rice. This is my favorite rice. So my mother-in-law is trying to force me to eat jasmine rice. But it's like, okay, jasmine rice is good and it's healthy for you. Okay, you know, you can't eat this every day, supposedly. But I like Uncle Ben's rice. And I love Uncle Ben's rice. Okay, and then he black at that. So you got to support Uncle Ben. You got to support him. Just like Ancient Mama um, Syrup. You got to support Ancient Mama Syrup and pancakes and all that, you know? So, yo, guys, I got some salad. Butter Bliss. And this is with butter lettuce and red leaf lettuce. This is my favorite lettuce. This lettuce is my go-to. If there's no other lettuce, I look for this one first before I look for anything else. If they have this, then I'm set to go. Butter Bliss. And then I got me two bell peppers. Two green bell peppers. I got me some cheese. Some Mexican style for cheese. I didn't get the cheese in mind of anything. I just know I always need shredded cheese. So that's why I got it. I always need bell peppers. That's why I got that too. And then a salad. I'm on a diet, so I need a salad this week. So I got the uncured hardwood smoked turkey bacon. And this is for my honey. This is the bacon he likes. Um, he don't eat pork, so I gotta buy turkey. Um he put me on to turkey because how much I buy for him. So I end up cooking and I might not have no pork. And then I end up eating his. And then that's how I got turned on to, to um, turkey. But I did give me some pork bacon. Some naturally hardwood smoked thick cut bacon by Bar S. This is some pretty good bacon. If you're looking for some good bacon, there you go. 
And I did get some TV dinners for my baby. The cheesy rice and chicken banquets. I never tried this, so I was like, okay, this might be good for Jamarion. Cause I used to be, we used to, this all we used to eat when I was a little one. These TV dinners, I'm telling you. And then I got, I am, I don't think I ever bought these for him. But I got spaghetti and meatballs for him so I can cut the meatballs up and the spaghetti, just chop it up real good. Um, And I got the garlic knots. It's always good just to have these on hand because I like to cook spaghetti and, and I, like, I like to cook pasta. So it's always good to have on hand. And I would just eat this by itself. And my honey, he love them. I did get my honey some Boston Market Homestyle Meals Salisbury Steak with um, a Rotel pasta. So yeah, that's one of his favorite TV dinners. So these are, if I'm not around, cause he don't know how to cook, I buy him TV dinners. So he can just pop that in there or he can eat noodles or cereal. It's a lot of stuff that he can pop, pop in cause he can't cook. So if I don't cook, he won't eat. If it ain't no um, things around here to cook in the microwave. I got Jamarion two apples. He loves apples. He love them. So I just got him two. But I got him two little ones, you know, cause I, you know, fruit go bad fast. So he gonna eat one of these. I'm not gonna let him eat two in a day, I'm not. So I'm not gonna let him eat this whenever he wanted to eat it and then he can eat this the day after that. Cause he can't eat both of them the same day. But I got him two apples for now. I did go ahead and get me, um, oh, I got a cucumber, you know, to go my salad. I love cucumbers. And another thing for breakfast for my honey and my baby boy is a turkey skinless smoked sausage. These are really good. I eat these um, as well. So everything I'm showing you guys, I eat as well too because I've been cooking this a long time. We've been together for four years. Four and four years and two months and some days. So yeah, we just hit our four year mark. And I've been, he's been eating turkey ever since I met him and before. So he really has put me on. So I got me some CPAC shrimp and seafood butterfly shrimp. I always eat these. My family always eat these. We love these. Fry them up in some oil, some hot oil, and eat it with some cocktail sauce, and you will have you a ball. These are so good. So good. Butterfly shrimp. Not coconut shrimp. Butterfly. I can't stand coconut. I put it in my hair, but I can't stand it, and I think I'm allergic to it. I'm allergic to coconut and... Um, Something else, like I can't put it on my skin, so I don't, I don't know. I probably shouldn't put it in my hair either. That's why I had to go to the hospital. I mean, to the urgent care recently to get me some um, a specific shampoo for my hair and my face. It was eating me alive. But I'll talk to y'all about that in another video. Okay, so I got TGI Fridays mozzarella sticks with marinara sauce, and it say now with seasoned panko breading okay so the bread and the seasoning so these looks pretty good i tasted them before i'm gonna give them a try again to make sure i like them or not but i know i like friday i know i like the baked potatoes with the bacon and cheese in it i know y'all know about that so that's something definitely i always get and then i always get the little burgers the little cheeseburger slides with the bacon on it and, the, and it's in barbecue sauce oh my gosh they come with four in the pack it's so good y'all I said, let me just try them. Let me just get the mozzarella sticks this time. I got this for Baby Bear, Jamarion, uh, some pizza rolls. And I got him the um, cheese sign because he can't, remember, he can't eat pork. I'm the only one that eats pork in the house because I grew up off that. That's just something that he wanted to enter. But I wasn't against it because it's, I'm never against something to make somebody better or healthier. So I didn't mind it. But I got these for my son. Wildberry Pop Tarts. Um, I'll give him one out of the pack. Sometimes you eat two, y'all. But I'll put in a toaster for him, maybe for breakfast or for lunch, you know, as a snack or something, and give him that, and he's good to go. Okay, these are my favorite pickles. These are the only pickles I ever get now. Ever since I've been put on this since I was younger. Um, these pickles do not come out the aisle that is hot. You know what the can goes. These pickles are by the Lunchables and cheeses and stuff like that. These are, it's by dairy stuff. That's the cold stuff. This, this is cold right now. This is cold. So I just want to put y'all on. They have the full one. They have the bigger ones than these. You know, the um the ones for um sandwiches. They got the ones for sandwiches. And they got the, um I don't think I've seen the little ones. I just seen the flat ones. Like the flat, 
the flat pickles, and I think I seen the um the round ones too. But I always just get the spears. I always get the spears, and it's so good. It got all this stuff at the bottom that really just it. And the, the taste is just out of this world. Just remember this name. And be and make sure you put down at the bottom. Tamika, you put me on. Because these motherfuckers are pickles. It's bad to know, motherfucker. Okay, you guys. I finally... I tried to buy these offline, but I was like, no, nah, I don't want to buy these. I don't want to buy these. I'm going to talk them to the store. But these are my favorite K-Cups. This is my favorite K-Cup, you guys, as of right now. And I try a lot. I try Dunkin' Donuts. I try Starbucks. Like, let me show y'all my um, Keurig, as a matter of fact. So, this is my Keurig machine, right? Well, I'm going to give y'all a tour of my apartment, too. That's going to be another video. Okay, so this is my Keurig machine. And these are the different things that I have in them. So, I tried a lot of Keurigs. Like, okay, say, for instance, Folger Black Silk. That's something that my honey gets because he just like his coffee black. Um, So, he tried, he got that. And then he got the Starbucks French Roast, too. So, we tried a lot of Starbucks when Starbucks is cool. It's okay. Um, donut Shot Nutty Caramel. It's okay. It's not all bad. It's okay. Nutty Caramel. That's what I've been um, drinking lately. This one is so weak and, it, and it's nasty to me. Cappuccino French Vanilla. But my sister didn't like it, but I don't. It's And I don't even know. Just look at that picture because it got the picture on the outside of the box i don't like it it's weak and i don't even like my strong coffee that strong it's just that that's weak on top of the creamer so i do have the duncan donuts french vanilla which is something that i'm really not a fan of it just tastes like um regular coffee to me um it's, it's okay it's not something i'd be like oh let me get duncan donuts french vanilla so i still got a box of these it's not that many left in here it's three it's three left in this box, so I'm about to throw that away. And then, yes, three left in this box. And then I got the Folgers Classic Roast. So this is something always good to have on hand because this is just regular coffee. And this is for my honey. So that's medium. I get the regular. I get the um the flavored coffees. He gets the um the regular coffee. So when people come over, they get the both of the best of both worlds. I do have tea up here. And I do have um, the K-Cups for the um, hot chocolate. And also, you guys, I've been, I had tried this. It's not that good. I got to try it with milk. I just tried it with water. But y'all let me know if y'all like the new um, hot chocolate, the white chocolatey goodness in a mug. White chocolate indulgent collection flavored with other natural flavors by Swishmas. Let me know if you guys like it or how to, how to, um, Drink it to make sure it tastes good. I think I probably need to put some ground cinnamon in there because it's just, it wasn't good to me. It had a really, really bad taste. Like it, it was gonna make me throw up, but I drank like half my cup and that was it. I couldn't do no more. Okay, so let me show y'all what I got else. So I got Jamarion for Lunchables, like I said, and I was happy because I usually get him the one with the Reese's, but this Smith's had worms for him. I always get him the turkey cheddar or the turkey American. So, he never gets like bologna or ham or anything like that. I mean, oh, they don't even have bologna. On the, no, I think they do have bologna. They do have bologna on Lunchables. So, I never get him the bologna or anything like that. I just get him turkey. No ham, no nothing like that. So, yeah, just the turkey. Um, once I have got him the cheese one before. Just the cheese one, not without the pepperoni. Just the cheesy piece of one. Um, so, I got four of these, you guys. Four of these Lunchables, they come in any. They come with the juice, the worms, the cracker, the set, the meat, and the cheese. They come in handy. They really do. So I got four of these. And then I got this big thing of canola oil. Canola? Canola oil? Pure canola oil by Kroger brand. I just was like, let me get that to put that in my cabinet because you can't never go wrong with having oil in your cabinet. And I got three of these, you guys. I told y'all I love these. These are high, though. They were like $10, but they were on sale, if I'm not mistaken. They were supposed to be on sale. So I hope I got them for the sale price. But anyways, this donut thing was, um, it only comes 10 in here. So that's what I don't like. I could get the bigger one from a Walmart, but... You know, I went to that Walmart last time. They didn't have them, so I was so happy they had them here. I just had to get three. I had to cop three of these, y'all. 
I had to, so these is 30. So yeah, Walmart do have the 30 one. But yeah, I had to cop three of these. Show y'all the other one. So I got three of them. And then, oh, you guys, I ate raisin canes yesterday. And um, I had got the candy at combo. Let me show you guys that. Raisin canes. It was so good. But make sure you guys say extra crispy because they didn't, they, they have to do it for us too. Okay. So I got me a box of chicken flavored maracha noodles. Yes, y'all. I'm going to put y'all on. Make sure y'all get some of these. Well, whichever flavor y'all like. Y'all might like different ones like shrimp, beef. This is my favorite one and this is the only one I really eat. I will eat beef. That's every once in a blue moon though. I can't eat beef like I eat chicken. I can eat chicken every day. Um, So you guys, now I'm gonna go to the water. I did get two cases of 32 packs of water. So let me show you guys. I got two packs of these waters right here. Two packs of these. Because I already got a water in my pantry. And then I got my son the freaking grape flavored um water. Let me show you the right way. Grape by Kroger too as well. And this is the flavored um water, and they're the little ones to make it more interesting for him to drink because he don't like water. So I'm trying to start him off with this and then I'm gonna give him regular water. So I actually got You look nice. Go get some drink. Is that one? What kind of drink? Drink. No, it's not one because you're on medicine. So this is strawberry water, flavored water for him with the little one. You get you talking about like a beer? No. Oh. You love me? With all of my heart. That's the same person that didn't um right here. Let me show y'all. That's the same person that didn't help me with the tree yesterday. Same person that didn't help me with the tree. You feel me? But they like me look good though. Look, I like your boy. Ain't nobody worried about that. So, nobody worried about that. Anywho, on to the next. Um, so y'all, that's my big grocery haul. And all together for all the food that y'all seen, because I don't think I put nothing, put nothing away yet. So for all the food y'all seen, that was one forty-eight fifty-four from Smith. It would have been more, but I used my card on there to lower the price. You know, a Smith's card. So make sure you guys get a Smith's card. Okay. Now I'm going to tell y'all how much the K-Cups was. So the K-Cups was on sale, you guys. Woo! I saved $4 each on each box. The, the price came out to be... $5.99 each because they were $10 each. That's too much. And then uh, the water, the Kroger water was, uh, flavored water was $2.79. The, the um, flavored water and it's come with 15 bottles. That was $2.79. And then the big water was $2.99, 32 pack. So hmm, that's questionable. The ramen noodles, the case of ramen noodles was $4.99. The oil was $5.99. Ben Rice was $4.79. I actually got Cookie Crisp too. So that was $4.19 for that cereal. For Cookie Crisp. And I got another box over here, you guys. I mean, another bag over here. I, I didn't show y'all. But it might just be cereal. Yeah, it's just cereal. It's cereal. Look. So the Captain Crunch, I was saying about the Oops All Berries. The Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And then the Cookie Crisp. And that's my snack bag I have brought. But, um, huh? Open it up for long here. He might as well take me Oh, out. here. Maybe. Yeah, he can. Huh? I mean, yeah, he's already in the car. That's all smart to me. Get away. But you know, Mama said we gotta move the car, man. Oh. oh, like moving around, huh? Yeah. We haven't moved, yeah. Nope. 
I might go to my mama house though. Why are you here with your company? I said I might go to my mama house. Okay, hold on. Let me get my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And this was the best gross y'all ever. And um, I'm going to try to do more videos like this. Did you knock on the door? Why? She probably just came up, babe. Eh? No, she's been right there. I just seen her. Hang on. Finish your video. Oh. Um, okay, so you guys make sure you subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed it and you want me to do more. And then I'll see y'all next time. But I think I'm gonna do another video because I gotta do a house tour. So see you later guys. Follow me on my YouTube channel. It is called Understanding Royalty. Thank you and have a nice day.